So time for the Irish Grand National next then. Uh, we've just got 17 in it, I think. We've got a Scottish Grand National coming up tomorrow as well. So big week for long distance races this week. And we'll see the two of them spread about. It's three mile and five furlongs this time, this one. Uh, we've also got the Whitbread as well on the last day of the week as well. There's Neymar de Silva, Paul Rhodes at the top. Joe Farrell for John uh, Morgan. Timothy Dalton for Paul Rhodes. Pray for the Queen. Joshua Sutherland, French Foreign Legion, Darren Thompson, Blackbird. David Robertson, picking a basket, Connor Agante. Last suspect, Kevin Minahan. Hill, Billy Boy, David Robertson. Tills with Glen Boy for Obi-Wan. In traction, Kevin Minahan. Wild Prince, Doug Warren. Now and then, Martin Little, Montoya. James Follis, Tara's man, Alex Cherry, Admiral Bing. Graham Clutterbuck and half Howard Hancock for Stu Gray. And that's a field of just 17 then. And away they go. That little roadway and round towards the first of the fences, which you can see in the distance. It's the first of 22 that they take in this Irish Grand National. So not a big jumping test for a Grand National, then just 22 fences. And they skip over the first one then and they're all safe to the other side with now and then. The early back marker, Pig in a Basket and Joe Farrell are disputing the lead. Looks like it's going to be an Arrogante Morgan Jewel to lead the way. Last suspect tucked in behind them in third. And a gap of about three lengths to the rest of them are headed by Tara's man. The roads pair it together as they take that ditch. And we'll save it to the side of that one with in traction now. The back marker, but Joe Farrell has won the battle to lead and is a length clear of Pig in a Basket in second. And last suspect for Kevin Meenan is third. Timothy Dalton in fourth. Took that slowly. The mistake by Alex Cherry's horse there as well. Tara's man. I've seen that one shuffle down the pack. Long Prince towards the outside. And the Cerise colours of Doug Warren just in front of that one. He's a French Foreign Legion. As they take number four. And a mistake by last suspect this time. They got away with it. Blackbird is now the latest one to be. Relegated to the back spot. There's still a fair old way to go though, as they skip over number five. And all safely to the other side of that one. And with Joe Farrell in the lead by about three down to pick in a basket second. Then last suspect is about three lengths behind that one in third. Then Timothy Dalton, then pray for the Queen and Neymar de Silva. Then Montoya and Half Hour Hancock, the only grey in the race, as they take that ditch. And all over that one as well, though. Blackbird skidding a little bit on landing at the back. Both of the David Robertson horses are closer to the back on the front at this stage. But there's still a long way to go. And Joe Farrell takes the seventh in the lead. Particularly good jump there by Pro for the Queen, seeing that one going to fourth. Joe Farrell is setting a stiff pace. Last suspect has just took a shade a second. Now then, wrong pig in a basket. And a gap back to Pro for the Queen and Timothy Dalton. And in traction and Neymar de Silva. Then Montoya and Admiral Bing now and then on the outside of that one. Half hour Hancock being pushed along on the inside. Then comes Tills with Glenboy and Hill Billy Boy. The French Foreign Legion between them as they take the eighth. All over that one as well. The back three now. Tara's man is still trying to recoil from that mistake earlier on. Blackbird and finally Wild Prince who's just finding the pace a little tough at this stage. And it is a Pretty strong pace for a long distance race. Mistake there by the first of the Paul Road horses. It was Timothy Dalton, a slightly lighter shade of horse than the other one, which is Neymar de Silva. And Joe Farrell is in the lead, but last suspect is now within a length in second. Picking a basket, drop back to third. And pray for the Queen in traction to the Minan pair to the four as well. The Rhodes pair are running in tandem as they take number 10. They're all still on their feet. One or two have been jumping a little bit sketchily. And Joe Farrell continues to lead from last suspect in second and picking a basket third. A little bit of a gap back to pray for the Queen in traction as they take the 11th. That's half the jumping done. They've got slightly less than two miles still to go. And Joe Farrell trying to lead all the way. Last suspect is second. Picking a basket third as they come past the stands, past the winning post, then with one more circuit to go. And it's Joe Farrell in the lead. Last suspect is second. Picking a basket three, and then praying for the Queen four. In traction is five, and Neymar de Silver is six, and Timothy Dalton is seven. And then Admiral Bring is eight, and Hillbilly Boy is nine, and then half hour Hancock, and now and then, then Montoya and French Foreign Legion with Tills with Glen Boy. Then the back three are Tara's Man, Blackbird, and finally Wild Prince as they take that one. Mistake by last suspect. They've got over it okay. 
Joe Farrell is back with a two length advantage. Last suspect picking a basket and praying for the Queen pretty close up and a little bit of a gap to Neymar de Silva and Timothy Dalton, Admiral Bing, who's making a forward move. So they skip over that one. And Wild Prince is the first forward right at the back. He's been struggling a little bit and he's out of the race now then. And Joe Farrell is in the lead. The Mina and Perra now second and third as they take the 14th. And we're losing another one at the back now. Blackbird is being pulled up, so that's two out. And I think Tara's man is beginning to tread water as well. But it's Joe Farrell who is the leader. From last suspect in second. And Pray for the Queen is third. Interaction is four as they take the 15th. Two tired jumps towards the back, but Joe Farrell still going well enough in the lead. From last suspect in second. And pray for the Queen in traction and picking a basket. Took that okay. Neymar de Silva is next. There's a big gap then back to Timothy Dalton. And unless these leaders tie up that back pack, are going to struggle to get into this. And Joe Farrell comes from a stable where they don't tend to tie up. And it's the 17th fence. And he skips over it in the lead. Joe Farrell and it is the leader by about three lengths to pray for the Queen in second. Last suspect and picking a basket. Neymar de Silva is now running on well. Then in traction. Big gap back then to the rest of them. We're headed by Timothy Dalton. And Tara's man has indeed been pulled up at the back. Montour is now the back marker. This is the 18th. And over that one, Joe Farrell led from in second place. Pray for the Queen. Then comes Pig in a Basket. Our suspect is still there. Also, still there is in traction. Timothy Dalton, Neymar de Silva. Timothy Dalton's getting back into it now. There's a gap then to Hill Billy Boy. Maybe the leaders are beginning to slow down a little bit because the backpack are beginning to close. And Joe Farrell, though, is still in front by about two lengths. From look at Timothy Dalton, who was looked out of it a minute ago, and he's now come right through to be the first one to throw down a serious challenge to Joe Farrell. Over the 19th they go. And it's Joe Farrell from Timothy Dalton. And Timothy Dalton suddenly takes it up. It's Timothy Dalton in the lead. Timothy Dalton. Joe Farrell fights back. Then comes in traction and pray for the Queen. Then Neymar de Silva. They're racing down towards the third last then in the Irish Grand National. And Timothy Dalton lands in front from Joe Farrell in second. The one that's making ground for the back is Hillbilly Boy. Also French Foreign Legion is beginning to run on as well. But it's Timothy Dalton who's gone for home. Timothy Dalton has got two more fences to take. Two fences between Timothy Dalton and Irish Grand National Victory. Joe Farrell now looks a little bit one paced in second. Neymar de Silva is trying to run on. French Foreign Legion is the other one who's trying to throw down a challenge, but they've got to get to Timothy Dalton over the second last. Timothy Dalton, here comes Joe Farrell with a second win. Then French Foreign Legion, then Neymar de Silva. Surely between these, one more fence to take and a further than a half to go. Timothy Dalton comes down towards the final fence in the Irish National. Skips over it nicely, gets away from it well. Then he's Stable companion Neymar de Silva is in hot pursuit, but it's Timothy Dalton who's going to take this one. Timothy Dalton is going to win this one, and racing up towards it on the Irish Grand National is staying in Ireland and it's going to the Professor. Paul Rhodes, Timothy Dalton takes it a 1 2 for the stable, Neymar de Silva second, pray for the Queen third, then French Foreign Legion and Joe Farrell and chills with Glenboy, pig in a basket, unseeding his rider towards the end of the race. Now, more Bing was pulled up, and it's a 1 2 for Paul Rhodes, Timothy Dalton the winner, Neymar de Silva second, pray for the Queen for Josh. Was third, French Foreign Legion Darren Thompson fourth, and long-time leader Joe Farrell for John Morgan was fifth.